So one day I decided I wanted to print a business card, but I really wanted it to be two-tone, you know, with the, the information in a different color. So I designed a business card in FreeCAD. Uh, here it is in my slicer. Uh, it's gonna be six layers high, each layer is 0.3 millimeters. So the first three layers are the business card with the no text. Here's the bottom one and then 0.6 and 0.9 millimeters. And then at 1.2 millimeters, that's where the text starts. So three layers of business card and then three layers of text. Here are the top three layers. So when you slice this and you look at the G code, um, I wanted to put uh, something in the code so that way I could uh, actually load a different colored filament. So I look for the, the Z height of 1.2, and then I can see uh, that there's a spot where the extruder is reinitialized re to zero right there. So now I'm just gonna add in a few lines of code, not very many, to, uh, to make it so I can put a new filament in. So the first thing I'm gonna do is pull my, pull my filament back a little bit so that that way I can easily take it out of the hot end then reset it back to zero, you know, make sure the printer is back where it thinks it thinks it was. Then I'm going to move my printer up to 150 millimeters, which is about, you know, halfway up uh, on my Delta Robot 3D printer. Give me some space to work with and then pause it for a few seconds, 20 seconds. Uh, after that, what I need to do is uh, change the filament and then put it back, put the printer back where it was supposed to be. So what I do is I, I put it back to uh, where it wanted to go plus 0.1 millimeters. Uh, that way uh, it, it gets there quickly and then it can move down 0.1 millimeters and then resume printing. And the speed I'll use is just the speed it's been printing at, which is 3000. So that, that's literally it. That's the full edit to the G-code for me to, uh, to change my filament mid-print. Uh, pretty easy. So here's what it looks like when it's printing. Uh, I'll speed this up a lot uh, just showing it. So. I'll put down the first three layers right here. And like I said, I'll run this really fast, so I think it'll speed up here in uh, you know, three or four seconds. All right, there you go. And I also cut it so you don't see the whole thing. So here's the first layer going down. Uh, then I cut out the second layer because I don't want to be too boring. And here's the third layer going down. So that's that third layer. It goes up to the 150 like I had said before. And then I pause my computer. I'm running Linux CNC, but you can pause whatever software you're using. After that, I get my black filament, and uh, I just change out the filament like you would any other time. Uh, and I make sure that I actually extrude uh, some of the filament in my hot end to make sure I clear out all the white. Otherwise, you know, half of the letters would be would be white. So uh, I've just loaded the black filament, and now I'm pushing uh, some black filament in the hot end to get the white filament that remained out. Once that's done. Uh, just hit play again on the uh, Linux CNC and then you'll see it print in black. So I have a white card with black letters printed on it. And I run this pretty fast as well. Uh, don't worry if your first letter looks a little ugly. Um, as long as you do a few layers, it'll, it'll work out just fine. Um, so I'll speed this up a lot uh, right, I think, here. Yeah, there you go. So this is what it looks like when it prints a uh, two-color business card. Pretty easy process. So that is it. Hopefully uh, you're able to duplicate this on your printer if you only have a single extruder.